Let's talk about the PDB, a little bit of today's news, yes. the presidential daily briefing. Did you get it? Did you ever sit in, sit in on it while you were um, DHS secretary? Every morning when I got to work at 6.30, my intelligence book is sitting there on my desk. And it was the first thing that I went through. I read it. Um, and then two hours later, I'd have a meeting with my staff where they would highlight for me what I've already read. And then if I had time, with all due respect to the press, I'd look at what the newspapers say to see how the press was actually covering so what I do. So we'd be third in that, in that line. Uh, somewhere in third in that line. What do you correct. make of Donald Trump um, not reading it every day and said uh, getting oral briefings sometimes? And this, and this, according to the report, 11 a.m. He's up all morning watching Fox News before that. Do you think that, are you concerned that his, what he sees on Fox News is coloring or skewing what he might be reading I know in his PDB? from personal experience that when you're in national security, your, intel your daily intelligence briefing are your eyes and ears for doing the job. And if you're not reading the intel, you're flying blind. Uh, it really is your eyes and ears for what we need to know about threat streams, about weak spots, about what foreign governments are doing, terrorist plots on the homeland. And so, you know, in a thick book, the briefer can highlight certain things. There are ways to cull out certain data that's particularly important. I saw that for three years when I was reading this stuff on a daily basis. Uh, but it, in my opinion, is indispensable for the president, for the Secretary of Homeland Security, or anybody else in national security to have access to Could this Could this stuff. be the most concerning thing about this presidency right now, that he's not paying close attention to the PDB? Well, I mean, none of us, none of us exactly know what he's told. Um, it does concern me that uh, anybody in his position uh, should be taking very seriously the obligation to understand threats to our homeland. And I think, in my experience, an indispensable part of that is reading the daily PDB. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.